Hello friends, in this presentation we are going to see what is asynchronous counter versus synchronous counter. So first of all we see what is asynchronous counter and then parallelly we are going to see what is synchronous counter. So in case of asynchronous counter, flip-flops are connected in such a way that the output of the first flip-flop drives clock of next flip-flop. It means that the clock which is given to the next flip-flop is nothing but the output of the first flip-flop. But in case of synchronous counter, there is no connection between output of the first flip-flop and the clock of the next flip-flop. It means that we are giving a separate clock to the each individual flip-flop. Moreover, it means the same. That is, clock is not simultaneously given and in case of synchronous, clock is given simultaneously. Circuit is simpler for more number of flip-flops as we know that the clock which is given to the next flip-flop is nothing but the output of the first flip-flop. So there will be no change in the circuit as we increase the number of flip-flops. But in case of synchronous counter, as circuit becomes complicated for more number of flip-flops, It is obvious that the speed of asynchronous counter will slow as the clock propagates in number of stages. Means that, let us suppose consider the last flip-flop may need to re uh, may need to wait until the output of this preceding flip-flop is given to that. But in case of synchronous counter, speed is high as the clock given at the same time. It means that we are giving a separate clock which is simultaneous to the all flip-flops. So that's all between asynchronous versus synchronous counter.